Now, as Louisiana joins the states that are reopening or beginning to reopen their economies, that can mean more and more crowds. Now, this also means more questions about where you are safest when you go out. Danny Monteverdi has a look at where one researcher says you're most and least safe and why. Until there's a vaccine, there will still be a risk from COVID-19. But there are some places that are safer than others, as one researcher has found. Dr. Aaron Bromage at the University of Massachusetts Dartmouth studies immune systems. He's analyzed a lot of data about COVID-19 and has a few key points. Restaurants and offices are where the virus can probably spread a little more easily. That's because you're seated for a long time around a lot of other people, and if someone in that group has the virus, it might be recirculating in the air. Indoor sports also poses a threat. Think about it. All that cheering you do forces a lot into the air around you, and if someone has the virus, it could be floating around as well. Exactly what you said, the screaming and yelling, um, breathing releases a little bit, talking a little bit more, screaming, yelling, singing, even more gets projected out. Where might it be a little safer? There are some indoor spaces that are safe and outdoors. Somewhere like a grocery store or a shopping mall with proper social distancing since they're larger and you're not in there as long, unlike an office or a restaurant where you might stop and sit down and relax for dinner. Outside is also generally a safe place. That's because it's just harder for the virus to try to latch onto someone. You have to put, you know, biology mitigation methods in place to slow the spread of this down um, and so that everybody can then participate in the economy. As Bromage says, if you don't solve the biology, the economy won't recover. Danny Monteverdi, Eyewitness News. And in a city like New Orleans, we don't want to hear this. Weddings and parties are also high-risk places because of the close contact we have with each other at those types of events.